you are in complete control of what you do with your life. It's as simple as that. You make your own choices. You choose what you want to do, both big decisions and small ones that you make from day to day. Life is all about choices. So if you're currently unhappy in your life, why not make a change? Why not do something to better yourself? If you're truly unhappy, you should make the choice to take care of yourself and better yourself. And I know that's vague, but honestly, I feel like it applies to all situations. It's not meant to be specific. No matter what you're going through that's making you upset or dislike your current situation, you have the power to change and improve your life. You have the freedom and the free will to change something in order to make things better. I'm not saying it'll always be easy. It definitely won't. Nothing is easy, and there are definitely some things that happen to us that we just can't control. Life happens, and there's a lot that we just don't have any sort of power or control over and can't change but you do have the power to do anything you want to do, and at least try to make any sort of change that you want to make. You can accomplish anything you want if you put your mind to it. I've learned the hard way that our time here on Earth is very limited. Anything can happen at any moment, so while you're here, you might as well do your best to enjoy it. You might as well do whatever it is that you want to do that makes you happy. Instead of wishing that you were happy, you should put effort into getting to a happier place. I've fallen into this bad mindset before, saying, I wish I was happy, I wish things were better. Maybe things will be better next month or next year. Maybe things will start looking up. But what I've learned through that is that if you want things to be better, you have to actually try to make them better. Nobody is going to do it for you. You have to take the reins and take control of your own life and choose to make an effort into doing something about it instead of wishing and waiting. If you're unhappy, the only way out of it is to do something about it. And what you do do about it is your choice. I'm making this video because people genuinely need to hear this. You listening, you probably need to hear that you can make things better if you just put the effort in. But nobody can make you. It's like the old saying, you can lead a horse to water but you can't make it drink. You have to make the decision to better yourself on your own. And what I'm saying isn't anything new or groundbreaking. There's probably tons of motivational videos out there saying the exact same thing. You can listen to videos like this as much as you want, but it won't change anything until you actually take the advice and act on it. And that is what people need to hear. I know I needed to hear that a couple years ago. I needed to hear that if I want my situation to be better, I actually need to attempt to make it better. I learned that after a while of waiting for things to get better and seeing no results. But I wasn't seeing results because I wasn't actively doing anything to change anything. And you absolutely can choose to do nothing about it, but you won't get anywhere by doing so. You won't grow as a person or improve. You have to take action to pursue happiness, whatever that means for you in your specific situation. Whatever your own wants and needs are, it's okay to focus on those things. It's okay to seek fulfillment in what you enjoy. Set goals for yourself to achieve and work on progressing towards them. And you should never be alone. It's okay to accept help and support from those around you. Surround yourself with people who will support you and lift you up. People who are a positive influence on your life and who support your goals are important because it's important for you to know that you're never alone and that you have people you can rely on when you need them. People who will lend a hand when you're in a bad situation or are going through something. You deserve to be cared about. But also be careful who you do surround yourself with. Be selective. Don't keep people around who will only negatively affect you. Harmful relationships will only drag you down. And we all know at least one person who is constantly negative and only ever shares their negative opinions. It's important to not let others' negative opinions affect you. A lot of times, people's opinions are based out of their own insecurities and fears. Some Sometimes even jealousy. And if there is going to be negative, they don't really need to be in your life in the first place. You should do what you want with your own life and you have the freedom to do so. Now do I mean to disregard everyone? No, absolutely not. Other people's help and feedback is important, but there's a difference between constructive criticism and projecting negative opinions and judging. You don't have to do something just because someone thinks that you should. You're the only person that you have to live with for your entire life. Just don't take that to an extreme if that makes sense. What I mean is that you should pursue your own wants and goals over other people's opinions of what you should be doing with your life. Live to fulfill yourself. The ones who do support you and your goals are the ones that you should keep in your life. The people who are there for you and will stick by you no matter what. The people willing to help you get to where you want to be. Those are the people that matter. And through everything, remember to be yourself. Subscribe if this helps.